Hi everyone, it's Muriel. I have some happy mail I'd like to share with you. I received it today. It's from my good old buddy Marcy who lives in Florida. Hi Marcy. Uh, she had chatted with me a couple of days ago, mentioned uh, she was sending me some extra goodies that she picked up and found at Tuesday morning, I believe. So thank you so much for thinking of me. We were chatting today. I was at Daiso. I got off work and I ran to Daiso because I wanted to get some of those petty white containers. First, I saw them on Laura's channel and I know that uh, Creative Young Mama had some. I even asked her if her Daiso had some. She didn't know, but she said she'd check. Then I saw Scrapstress video of her fabulous room. It's a beautiful room. Absolutely beautiful. And she has them in her uh, curio cabinet, let's just call it. And um, I went to my Daiso and of course they didn't have any, so I was quite upset. But I came home and I have happy mail and I did a little shopping uh, at some stores that were close by. So I'll show you those goodies. Um, so she sends me this cute little note. Just a few giddy goodies. I hope you like them, Marcy. I see there's a card. I'll open that up first. Thank you. Always thinking of me. Oh, you use the bird card. I love that. I have that stamp set. I have not opened it up yet. How cute is that? Oh my gosh, I love that. She says, you can never have too much happy. No, you can't, girl. Enjoy the goodies. Oh, just keep churning out those awesome crafty wonders. You inspire me every time. Love, Marcy, your crafty sister. Thank you. That is so cute. You did some watercolor. Is that what this is? It almost looks like it's suede. Really pretty. So I'm going to can't wait to put him on the um, clothespin, the big clothespin. So we got some goodies here. Oh, some filigrees. I love those. These are black glitter, glitter ones by me and my big ideas. Black flourishes. Thank you for that. And then I saw this. It's so cute. Look at that stamp. Kisses and double hearts. Very cute. Thank you. <laughs> one for you and one for me. <laughs> so cute. I love these. These are by Cosmo Cricut. They are tiny texts. Um, I have some Cosmo Cricut like letters, but I don't have any words. And these are really cute because they look like they're um, punched out on that little machine, that little handheld machine. Hi, girlfriend. I love my family. Oh, these are really cute. I could definitely use those. Thank you for that. And here she says, enjoy Marcy. And these are by Pink Paisley, Bella Rue. So they're like glitter stickers. Really sweet. Beautiful. Shine. Bright. They're just a bunch of words. And there's a butterfly in that cute little diamond. Thank you, Marcy. Everything is so nice. Let me just turn one of these lights out. Okay. And then she sent me some of these, which I love. I worked with them once on a project by Tim Holt. So she picked this up here at Hobby Lobby. Thank you for that. This is called um, Industrious Stickers. And I used them on a project, and they really, really look good. I used them on my Valentine's tags. That's what it was. And here's some more stickers she picked up at Hobby Lobby, which is really cool. Has everything to do with... Um, cooking, which, oh my gosh, I could certainly use these on Mia's um, recipe recipe book I'm making for her. It's so funny. Today she sent me a list of all the tasty recipes that she wanted. And um, some of them were really interesting, like slow cooker uh, chicken uh, pot pie and tacos and lots of good stuff. I was really impressed, so I can't wait to um, write them out on the cards. Oh, and this is cute. This is some vintage trinkets by Prima. Wow. See, you're, you ladies have the best Tuesday mornings in the land. I tell you, mine is so hit and miss. And then by the time I do go there, it's all gone. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But thank you for sending me those. I know I don't have any of that. So let's see what's in here. Oh my gosh. Oh, how cute. These are wooden charms. I love that. Oh, and that could be used, too. You can see all the gizzards from these all down in here. I love those hearts. They're all like, um, like they have lines on them. Beautiful. Oh, Marcy, thank you. And then these here, 
There's 52 pieces, so they have the word wooden pieces here with the words on them and then the picture frames. Oh, I can definitely use these. Thank you so much. Wow, I haven't seen any of this. Oh. I tell you, Tuesday morning, it's the place. Okay, and what do we have here? Excuse me for the crinkle wrinkle. Okay, so she got me some mix and mingle beads and charms. <laughs> Those are cute. That, if you can see, it has like a deck of cards. It says that it's the 10 Jack, Queen, King, and Ace. How cute of a chunky charm, purse charm would this make? Oh my gosh, that is so, so cute. And then she sent me a Art Eye Cake charm. This is a pendant with the glass. This is really pretty. I love Art Eye Cakes. And then she got me these. Oh my gosh, these are from Home Goods. Oh, I love that store, by the way. But I never find, find crafty stuff there. I think I found the paper clips a couple of weeks ago. Me and my girlfriend went at lunchtime. I can't even tell you where they are. Let me see if they're behind me. Nope. So, and that was all I found was a pack of paper clips. But these are cameras, paperclip cameras. These are so cute. Oh my gosh, Marcy, thank you so much. I'm going to use these sparingly, like once on the project every six months. Oh, and then she sent me some gas, um, glassine pockets, which I've used before. So thank you again. These are six tag envelopes. Oh my God, I love my Tim Holtz stuff. You know that. And then my Martha Stewart, these are gilding sheets. Oh my gosh, so there's 12 sheets in here. And I think you can use this for... Use these gilding sheets to create elegant projects for your home in a variety of surfaces. Okay, I'm going to have to look up on this. This is really pretty. I love those colors. Poor Martha Stewart. She's just... Gonna, uh, we're just losing her left and right. And then this is some beautiful lace trim. Oh my gosh, this is normally $10 and they were 99 cents at Tuesday morning. And you can see how she used it on a pillow. <gasps> gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Four different designs and they are all beautiful. Hmm, maybe I should try that. Putting um, some on a pillow. Wow, Marcy, thank you for thinking of me. I so appreciate it. And then she sent me these paper doilies, which are beautiful. They're gold and silver. So pretty. And you can see the there's 18 pieces, so there's probably um, three of each of those designs. Gorgeous. Marcy, thank you so much. I love everything. I so appreciate you thinking of me because I know you didn't have to do this you could have just kept it all for yourself <laughs> but you're so generous and i so appreciate you so much she chimed in with me today when i was at the mall when i didn't find the um baskets that i was looking for and i was it was just right on time and that's how marcy is right when you're having that moment ding there's marcy is on the cell phone i uh, send you a message so i so appreciate this and i love this card I have got to pull my birds out and use them this summer because these, they're so, so cute. <laughs> so, um, so like I said, when I went to um, Daiso, they didn't have what I was looking for. But let me just really quick, because I did uh, yesterday, if you recall, I stopped in uh, Walmart. I was looking for a slip for my daughter and some other stuff. And while I was there, I found these Project Life photo pocket pages they were three dollars and 97 cents which is really good these are by becky higgins project life and my goal is to use my fuse tool and i'm going to scrap lift the idea of the shaker cards that creative young mama showed us all and hopefully this uh pocket pages are uh solid enough i know she was mentioning that some of the plastic cup uh you know 
uh, sleeves that are out there do not work very well so I'm hoping that these do and again ladies these are at Walmart they are $3.97 now I also because Walmart has a clearance rack I mean you can just find some it's hit and miss but I did find this beautiful wooden frame and it was five dollars on the clearance rack and I was so excited because you know I recently purchased this DIY gallery art from Hobby Lobby and I plan on using one of these um, affirmations in this picture frame so I could either use it as a 5x7 with the mat or a 8x10 without the mat so I was excited about that for five dollars and it's better home and gardens and I trust the name for sure so um, so I got those things and then um, Today at Michael's, I ran in, which is next door to Marshall's, um, and I found something I have been looking for. These are jewelry trays. They are by Create Created Space, which they're clearancing out. So this was the 70% off, and it's green, which is okay. It's going to be in my drawer, but I really need a better I, uh, better way of um, housing my jewelry because I wake up in the morning and I can't find matching earrings. I can't find the backs. I can't find the necklace. So I bought the last two that they had. And then the other day or last week or whatever, I bought another one, different one from Michael's that was... Um, wider spaces so I have three now for my top drawers and hopefully that will be enough to house the jewelry that I have um, I got these two from the dollar fifty spot they have those small little clips in them and the reason why I got them one I love the case uh, the tube but I need those little clips when I'm at work a lot of time my boss will come over and say do you have some of those clips and yeah, granted we can order them which is fine um, but um, we tend to order bigger ones not a lot of small ones so I saw those so I got them so I'm gonna take these to work and um, just have them on hand and I did um, look through their clearance aisle at this Michaels and for $1.25 I found this Pemberley bead landing charms and I like it because of this one here where it says admit one so cute the others are cute too but that's what caught my eye and I found some candles for 29 cents each. These are Ashland. I don't know if they have a scent to them. You can just say they're cherry. But this was all that was there. So each candle was 29 cents. And then uh, let's flip back over to Marshall's. I picked up um, this um, Snap Simple Stories uh, set here. Now this is all that was inside the pack. Obviously the cards at the bottom were missing so she let me have this for two dollars. It's normally $3.99. Well actually it was two fifty. dollars she, she clearanced it down. It's normally $3.99. So there are a bunch of the larger cards missing but um, I can get by with that. I liked them because it was all about birthday. Right? So then I saw this one. Well, I got these straws. Let me show you these straws. I got these straws, and I might already have these, or I might not, but they were a dollar, and they're really cute. And I got this, which was $2. This is a very tall notepad, and that's just what it's called. It has a magnet, and I have a file cabinet at work, so I'm going to be sticking this on the file cabinet. thought that was really fun. And then, um, this is what I um, found. Oh, I got this jar, this cute mason jar. I'm going to paint this one. This was $1.99. I love the lid on it. And um, this here, I'm going to be hanging some of my pretty trims on and hang it in my closet is actually a uh, tie and belt rack but I'm going to be hanging laces on it I think it'll look really cute I already put it in my closet so it would hang right here and then the laces would just cascade down okay and then I have a I have a small problem somebody um, video I was watching did some shopping I want to say at TJ Maxx or Marshall's and she had one of these and she said I know I should have got another one but I didn't 
and I didn't think nothing of it until I saw it today and I and I picked it up and I want to send it to you but I don't remember who you were I've been looking back on my videos going who was that who said that so if you are the one send me some kind of message and then I want to go back to your video to make sure that you're the one that I want to send this to because um, I have missed the Disney thing my daughter's 20 years old and granted we probably can go but not in this t not not no time in the next five years I know so um this person again just bought this and said that they wanted to have another one and I just don't know who it is so if you go ahead and email me if it was you just let me check your video out to make sure and I'll be more than happy to send that to you so that is that um I did get an online Perch haul today, which I'm so glad it came in. It's from Scrapbook Outlet. That's Gina Design Stamps, who have the wonderful price on these dies. So let me show you. I got me the Scallop Stitch Frame Set, which is so, so pretty. I cannot wait to use it. And these are so inexpensive. You all know that. I got the Loopy Circle Die Set, which I'm happy about. I got some Sympathy, sympathy Stamps. Which a lot of times, you know, I usually use my own words, but it would be nice just to have a little. And they're small enough that you can just stamp them and they can be on the outside of your cards. Look at this. Though we may shed tears, we can smile knowing they walked with the Lord. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, then I got this Buck and Doe Thinlet dies. Look how cute that is. And if you go on her site, she has lots of um, beautiful cards, um, like a card gallery. And you can see how they're used. So, so pretty. That's going to match a Christmas collection uh, that I bought last year. And then I got these funny birthday sentiments. I love this one. Happy birthday to my favorite geezer. Me and my daughter always use that word. To the geezer over there. Yeah. Happy 29th birthday again. Oh my gosh. Happy anniversary from your escape of the womb. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you know, I say some crazy stuff, but I never thought about that one. Okay. Happy birthday. I got you a card. So cute. And then last, I got the Fern die set. So, so happy they came in. They're really expensive. I tell you, they're no more than $10. You can find some for $3. So, go check out her um, her um, website. I believe it's um, Gina Marie Designs or Scrapbook Outlet, one of the two. And she um, has a, a variety, like 16 pages of different dies and stamp set. So, thank you again, everyone, for watching my haul. And tell me who you are who said... I know I should have got another one of these. You were working with a book. I looked and see if it was Sabrina, and I wasn't sure if it was her. I know she just did a flip book, so I'm just betwixt right now. So um, help me out here. And thanks again for watching. Have a wonderful evening, everyone. Bye now.